Unmanned aerial vehicles have emerged as a pivotal element within military aviation, and when fused with aerial ruling capabilities, they give rise to a synergy that embodies the pinnacle of military aviation advancement. Standing tall in this domain is the MQ-25 Stingray, a technological marvel that has etched its name prominently in the annals of aviation history. Join us today at Aerotech as we delve into the captivating realm of this extraordinary aviation innovation. The Concept In the year 2006, United States Navy initiated the unmanned carrier-launched airborne surveillance and strike program. The UCLAS program was designed to develop an unmanned aircraft that could be used for a variety of missions, including aerial refueling, intelligence, surveillance, and strike. In 2014, the Navy awarded Boeing a contract to develop the MQ-25 Stingray, which was selected over proposals from General Atomics and Northrop Grumman. The first-ever MQ-25 Stingray test article was built and tested in 2018. The Manufacturing The MQ-25 Stingray is being manufactured by Boeing at its St. Louis, Missouri facility. The first production aircraft is scheduled to be delivered to the Navy in 2024. In September 2018, Boeing was awarded a $805 million contract to develop for MQ-25A aircraft. An additional three test MQ-25As were ordered on April 2, 2020, for a current total order of seven. The program may expand to $13 billion overall and consist of 72 aircraft. The first flight of the MQ-25 Stingray T-1 test asset took place on September 19, 2019. The MQ-25 Stingray T-1 refueled an F-A-18F Super Hornet for the first time on June 4, 2021. The MQ-25 Stingray is expected to enter service with the Navy in 2025. The Technology the MQ-25 Stingray is powered by a single Rolls-Royce AE 3007N turbofan engine and has a maximum takeoff weight of 50,000 pounds. The MQ-25 can carry up to 13,500 pounds of fuel, which it can transfer to other aircraft using a ProBand Road refueling system. And it is a carrier-based aircraft, that means that it can be launched and recovered from an aircraft carrier. 